guys, it's me, Sire Anime Protagonist VTuber, and welcome back to Cyrus Reactions, where I react to anime that are in my to-watch list. And we're back for our one of our spring 2022 anime that we are watching weekly and getting frustrated about. Yame, well, Yusha Yamimas. I'm uh, I'm quitting heroing in English. So. Uh, basically, uh, I have adjusted my expectation of, of this anime. So, because uh, I judged it because it was like in a fantasy setting with demon lords and heroes and shit, I was expecting it to be a fantasy anime power series or, you know, some sort of uh, fantasy isekai series with, uh, you know, power fantasy, fa action, you know, fighting and stuff like that. But, you know, it's not. It's not that. It's basically a slice of life anime based on a fantasy setting, you know. Uh, it's more of like a corporate <laughs> corporate slice of life anime, you know, how to manage a beast a business or how to manage a, you know, in this case a demon army. So uh you know, basically employee stuff, but you know, the fantasy setting making it more if it was it, it's like you know watching real life corporate stuff but more exciting because you know your manager is a succubus you're an overpowered employee um you're managing a bunch of you know demons monsters that are bent for the destruction of mankind you know just a regular day in the office <laughs> so yeah uh it's 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 a fun setting so we're, i'm not going to expect this to be some sort of power fantasy now at first i was expecting it to be some sort of power fantasy but nah it's not going to be a power fantasy stuff it's just going to be a slice of life anime with a fantasy set so basically last episode uh if, we're, if we could have a recap last episode episode two uh management issues so our hero was able to like uh you know you can be basically like parallel this in real life, you know. Uh, Shit, Shituna, Shituna, Shatina, Shatina, the succubus is one of your talent, most talented employees, but they don't know how to delegate. So basically, our hero saves the day by forcing her, or not, not forcing her, showing her the right way to delegate work so that she won't be overworked. So that's actually the problem with like uh, very talented and uh, you know talented and uh, you know uh, very loyal employees. They're they are a great asset to a company, but sometimes they overwork themselves to the point of exhaustion. So they they in the end they won't participate well. They you know they they won't be able to like be that productive. In the long run they, they could make like strides for the company but you know in the end you need work-life balance you need to know how to delegate even if you are the smartest guy in the room and you know you know everyone else is an idiot <laughs> compared to you even people with lower skills than you are are useful if you can delegate them simple tasks just so that you won't do everything else on your own um and that's what we learned next episode and now the next uh, this episode, according to the preview, it's going to be about Lily. You know, I guess we're going to learn about logistics <laughs> because she was assigned for logistics. And yeah, I can't wait for the reaction. Anyway, if you guys are new to the channel, I do anime reactions, but due to copyright issues, I am not putting any footage in my video. Uh, but I would put a uh, a timer so you can synchronize with a legal copy or a leaving a legal streaming service. I am currently watching this now in uh, Anyone Asia. So if you guys are from Asia, you can actually watch it for free there in YouTube. Actually, in the YouTube in their YouTube channel, it's free. So if you are in the West, I think it's in Crunchyroll or something. I don't I don't know. I have no idea where this is available in the West. But if you guys are from Asia, you can watch this in Anyone with me for free. So yeah, without further ado, let's start this. Uh, Yame Yusha, Yame Ma. <laughs> Yusha Yame Mas, or I'm quitting hearing episode three. Let's start this in three, two, one, go. Damn, we have a long introduction. So, Largo C. Ah, yes. 
So they're going to have like naval logistics stuff. Uh huh. <laughs> but I miss this isle, some beautiful bountiful paradise. Uh-huh. Already wacky demon army racers. What? Hold on. <laughs> what are they doing? Stop letting you. What? Okay, but she told So basically she's just playing around with the logistics stuff. Well, basically logistics is an important part. If you are like uh what do you call this? If you are especially if you're an army, like logistical supplies is very important, like managing it well. But <laughs> you know, they're assigning such an important role to a kid. I don't know what what the I think the demon army has management issues. Why are they assigning it her to her? I don't know. Maybe she was she's considered as an adult <laughs> for her species, but as she is projected now, uh, Lily is a kid, and she gets transformed into a white wolf based on this opening. So, should it be like, for example, the assassin guy? The assassin guy. I forgot his name one of the generals wasn't he isn't he like since he's an assassin he could have like knowledge of like roots and stuff he must that, that's i think the assassin person is much more qualified for this but i don't know maybe he's used he's being used as a oh no because he's as an assassin he's more perfect for espionage ah oh, man lily's headed tomorrow uh-huh demon army and people of Largo have steadfast and breakable alliance uh-huh land of the dragon folk huh <laughs> demon king belial attack the humans okay Others debate many denizens of the demon world found peace with humanity. Aha. Uh -huh. So they did went to peace. But that was a different demon lord. Why did that current so I'm guessing the current demon lord Ah, oh, okay. Humans can will be humans, they'll be assholes to other places. <laughs> oh they went to peace, right? The demons and the humans went to peace. Why did they attack again with Echidna? Invasion of open arms. Fighting against humanity for so long. Okay. So basically these dragon people are the ones supplying them with food and other things. Hmm. They want me to leave the Largo help a logistics mission. Okay. So foods and equipment stores are running low. Yes, manager. Everyone's gonna be happy time. What? Ports the <laughs> She's basically a kid. Why not said Edward? Uh huh. We can't send him. Huh? Okay. I get to get to it by the next one after that. End up doing. It. So basically, every single one of the generals are, are this elite. Uh, the four elite four have management problems 
They don't like to delegate stuff. Permanently after all. Uh huh. Don't go missing me so much. Is he hitting on her? <laughs> and she's a typical Sundar. I'm really sure she's. The castle's already destroyed, so I'm. I'm basically blaming Shotina for majority of this this. Uh, destruction now. She must be responsible for majority of the destruction now. So they're just running around. <laughs> Holy shit, they're just destroying the farmland and they're playing around. You don't expect. <laughs> oh boy. The dragon folk will be mad at them. They're just railing destruction. Guard port. Wait, they're playing around. I'm not playing around. What? Racing to see who could carry the supplies the fastest. What the fuck? She's okay. She's her logic is crazy. Stop as fun. Oh boy, she has she has management problems. She's a kid. She's having fun though, but that's an inefficient way for handling logistics. Is that a coconut? <laughs> oh boy. Uh huh. Now go out to work. Mm -hmm. Two days long, that's good, just come back. Okay. Carrots. <laughs> This is my future husband. <laughs> and we are not Mithrode. We are invited in a wedding. Oh boy. We need to focus on this repairs. Any changes to procedures to be signed by the verbals. Okay. The boss. Oh boy. Boom. Oh my god, the amount of mismanagement. Gonna take them long time. So nobody's following him because it's just a them. Ah. Uh. This is gonna be throwable. Oh boy. Ah. Uh. She's a sweet girl, but. Oh boy, she's worried about him having a headache. It's a metaphorical head, but she thought it was like. I suppose. Uh huh. Besides. Facilities are ruined. the battle against Hero Leo. He was going easy on us. My man is overpowered like he 
took on an entire demon army and he's that brick is wet man no wonder she hates him that much the demon queen the kidna uh-huh Okay. Oh boy, she's still searching for medicine. Carrots for medicine. She really likes him. Like with Shatina. Oh yeah, she's a kid. So logic doesn't work. Okay. What are you gonna do? Oh, he has a plan. Medicine. Uh huh. What's wrong with him? He doesn't look good. What happened? I got bit by a snake. What? A death viper. <laughs> so because, <laughs> oh my God, he let himself get bitten by a snake just to convince her. What a badass! Can't go back to the castle. Oh boy. So, what is his plan, though? Nobody I was surprised. Okay. Way to save my life. Make some medicine herbs. Should be growing up because Okay, so she's he's going to send her to a mission? Where's the threat? <laughs> oh boy. Oh he can just clean himself, okay? Aha. Uh -huh. What are you doing, man? Gonna manipulate a kid? <laughs> Trials. Okay, so you're going to send her to some sort of obstacle course. Use the power of teamwork. Okay. On the job training. Okay, so basically. Holy shit. He's treating her like an intern. He's going to treat her, her like an intern. <laughs> okay, she transformed into a wolf. She, he's basically treating her like an intern. Okay, so she could figure out what to do. Uh huh. I have no idea what she's able to destroy. So ready to reach the first trial, okay? Invincibility spell, huge border, nullify physical attacks. Okay. You need to find a support in it who can remove the spell. Oh boy, he's planning. Oh no. It's not working. She has to think. Think, girl! Find someone that can dispel that! So basically, he's setting it up so she can think about using a team. She can do it without a team. What? Yo! <laughs> to the board, don't be stupid. <laughs> oh boy, it's not working. So she's so strong that she can... It doesn't matter that that rock has invincibility spell <laughs> in less than a minute 
Oh boy. So this is a very inefficient way of breaking the boulder, but you know, that's what she knows. <laughs> Just move on with pure brute strength. Oh boy, Lily's strong. Looks like he underestimated her. Like, but she, he did fight her before, right? <laughs> okay, second trial. What's the second trial? <laughs> slimes. Replicating, indefinitely replicating slimes. Among those slimes is a single tiny slime, core slime. Uh huh. Take them out, the rest will go with it. Bring over perspective underling okay <laughs> someone case ice ice magic uh, what <laughs> oh, no, oh no she doesn't need subordinates she's very powerful <laughs> she's so strong she doesn't need subordinates so that basically the the elite for uh these four general generals of the demon army all have the same problem they are so strong and talented that they don't need subordinates. But that's an inefficient way for handling an entire army. <laughs> okay, is this like the third trial? You would have been the bottom of the It's my third trial. <laughs> uh huh. Get to the western peaks. Okay. God hot. Simple traveler. Okay. Should no, it's me. She gonna jump. She's gonna jump through it. With this impressive living ability, she can't make that job. <laughs> Tragic. <laughs> oh, well, they have a friend who could fly. They could help me fly across the gap. Oh boy. <laughs> He's training her for. We need to find from a friend, help from a friend. Oh boy. Teaching her about stuff. They have eagle stuff. <laughs> Off. Get her friend out here to realize the importance of teamwork. Okay, she's basically now going to find someone that would help her fly through this cavern. Ravine. That he made. He's so. She goes find it. What? They said I can just swim across the bottom. What the hell? <laughs> okay. <laughs> she, she did it in her way though. Oh boy. In the end, she's just doing everything on her own. <laughs> and just ask everyone for advice. Okay. Feeling better now. Uh, she's wagging her tail like a dog. So basically she's not a cat girl. She's a dog girl. Wolf girl. Ignorance is a bliss. Oh boy. What? Okay, what the hell is this? You think we could work like this? Okay. Oh, this is what he imagined. He imagined earlier, right? 
Did you think you're all by yourself? Mr. Godhart. Easier to work together with him. Well, basically she learned, okay, even though she he failed in she failed in every trial. Unless someone tells me. Oh boy. So he should have been straight forward against her, just tell her that and everything would have been okay. So basically you just need she's the type of girl that you need to teach straightforward to. So it wasn't a failure after all. The God heart stuff. She actually learned because someone told her that friend, you need to have friends. Everyone's super happy with work. Oh boy. Proper delegation of skills. So that logistics is fine. Wait till you come reliable leader. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh huh. What is the important stuff? I'm being made an environment deploying, huh? Black on his head. It's to report to me at once. Oh boy. Yo. Did the Demon Queen figure out? I <laughs> and we're done, so... Fuck, I have to wait an entire week. Damn it, I have to wait an entire week before I can, like, watch the next episode. Damn it. So yeah, this, is a, this was a fun episode. Uh, more corporate stuff. So, we're learning the fact that even the, the, this guy, the dragon guy every general is just so freaking strong that they don't know how to like handle like having subordinates because you know they're used to like doing everything by themselves so basically that's the main problem of the demon army they have too many talented people <laughs> that they don't know how to do teamwork they have problems with scalability i, I guess <laughs> And that's what the hero's doing. But he himself is overpowered. The, the hero's also overpowered. How is he able to like manage everything himself as well? But anyway, so yeah, I guess that's it. Drinking party from hell. So, yeah, I guess that's it. Um, let me just. So, uh, let me gather my thoughts. So, yeah, like I said earlier, like. Uh, the problem with the demon army is they have um, generals that are too powerful and too talented. <laughs> so basically, uh, I guess uh, Leon or you know Black Onyx Onyx Knight, <laughs> I forgot Black Onyx Warrior. Uh, so basically, our protagonist Miss uh, you know Miss Judge Lily, she's not a complete idiot. So I guess if he would have been straightforward, Lily would have understood. That's what I got from this episode. So basically, Lily is like a kid. Basically, he treated her like uh, an intern, <laughs> giving her an on the job training, but you know, she's so overpowered, she could do everything by herself. Like, no matter how, how many obstacles he tried to put on her, which required teamwork, but she just plows through because, you know, that's uh, the main problem. So uh, basically, the Demon Army is a corporation with a lot of talented individuals. But those talented individuals don't know how to play well with others. So that's their problem right now. 
and I'm guess I'm guessing the hero now, our hero, our protagonist, is fixing that by making them a very coherent organization. My my guy, my my dude is a good manager, man. He's he should be like um <laughs> he should be like senior management in the corporation or something. So uh Echidna Echidna should like uh you know uh promote this guy. So I'm guessing he's going to be summoned next episode. So I can't wait to watch it uh next week. See you guys. Um thank you guys for watching. I'm uploading this reaction. Uh I'm uploading Yami Yu yeah, you Yusha Yamimas or I'm quitting heroing uh reactions every thursday uh see you guys in the next reaction this is sire anime photographer youtuber thank you guys for watching goodbye